Greetings from the eccentric side. Here are your top stories making the rounds today, Monday, the 24th of July 2023. This is the eccentric news trends. We'll begin with this story. Your briefing. Top stories, row two. Channels television. Adam Doshi almost speaks on subsidy governance. Subsidy removal. Another Sunday politics video. Seven hours ago, row three. Adam Flo Shomondi speaks on subsidy removal. Cost of governance. It is the. Adam Flo Shomondi is one person that um, I must see that. People really have expected a lot from because of his past history with the government and the way he uh, his past history with the the um, NLC and the way he was very vital in fighting the government for the um, uh, for the um, what do you call it interest of the masses and to see him switch into the government, people thought it was going to be make a very big difference and then he went there and then. We could not see the difference between he and the others that we that we have been in power before he got there. So it's quite weird because we both had a lot of expectations, and then here we are. It seems he's one of those in government now that has forgotten where he came from. But it's fine. It's fine. Guess it will change. So next story. Newspapers, hashtag and start. 103 recovered bodies, not Lucky Tolgate victims. Dead Legos, five hours ago. 103 recovered, but not Lucky Tolgate victims. So, it made the round yesterday that, um, um, the Lagos State Government, what did they say, also gave approval of about 61 million naira for, um, for mass burial of NSAS victims. And then people began to speculate that this. Maybe they did switch and other that the delegate told gets were right after all. Maybe a lot of people actually died. And so yes, finally. And then finally. Um finally the people have been vindicated. When I saw the news I was not so sure of it because if you're going to be burying 103 people from the end start, i don't think that can be covered yes people may have died but i don't think a lot up to 103 people died at the lucky target they may have died during the end SARS protest but if 103 people died at one location i do not think it will be this coverable and this quiet 103 dead bodies is too many Yes, one if it's one person is one too many, but when it's hundred and three people that died at the Lake Target, I do not think it would be easy for the government to cover it or with the crowd that was there. Hundred and three people is, is too many body counts for the government to cover. So when I said I was like, no, I do not think this hundred and three people is, is from Lake Target, to be honest. I could not see that happening. I'm not supporting the government. What happened at the Lekki Togate was horrible. The government should never shoot at its citizens. Um, if it was only one person that died there, or only two people that died there. If it was only one person that got injured, it is horrible that the government will shoot at its... Uh, shoot to injure its citizens when they are complaining about the injustice they are facing with the police system in the state. So, even if it's one person that was injured, I understand, and I... I don't think it's, I think I was totally wrong with the government, but then, I don't think 103 people died at the Lake Kito Gate. I do not think so. Heaven wants for if you move to the Nubal's government, I think we'll just try to now. I think we should just go and sit, to be honest. I'm looking at the tribal now. Um, to the, um, Atiko has his... Um, uh, is pleading to the court for him to be president. Peter is pleading to the court for him to be president. I think Asiko should go and sit down. At what point will you understand that people don't want him to be president? Because he has tried a number of times. I think five, four or five, no, four times, maximum. I think it's in four and six times. I can't, I'm not sure the exact number right now, but he has tried a lot of times. And Nigerian has refused to vote him in. And he comes every time and takes his case to tribunal. 
What are his lawyers? I think the one of the force advisors are his lawyers. Because whether or not he wins the case, they get paid, right? I think they are not advising him enough. Because if they are, why? Every year, you keep on going to the tribunal and you keep on not winning. I think it's obvious that we, we don't want you to be president. It is quite obvious at this point. Even when you had Peter B as running mate, you still did not win. So it is quite obvious that you are not wanted at the president. Please just relax. Let others try. Maybe they might win the APC, but please. Article, you have the trend of being a loser. Please. Go, into, go back to your businesses or something. Thank you. And the they arrest drug law with 93 wraps of cocaine in Lagos. This drug problem is becoming, I think it's every month, every week or every two weeks that we catch on with a large amount of drugs in in the country and I don't understand how and why this is becoming from like this because the hardships in the country is too much and a lot of people are venturing into drugs or what could be the case at this point. Why does it seem like we have more people going into um drug related offenses nowadays? Like why? What's going on? I think this is good that um they keep on catching these people. See because they are clamping down more. Should that be the case? That is awesome. Because we do not want these drugs on our streets. Yes, it's quick money. But please. We do not want this. So well done to the NDLEA for this. And wish them more wins, I guess. Six for you. Row 11. Vanguard. CC. Alex under one roof again. Social media. Dogged. BB Niger. All stars. Come make it unveiled. Nine hours ago. Row 12. CC and Alex under one roof again. Social media on... Wow, so the Big Brother All-Stars, um, I would like to do a video, I hope I get the chance to do that, but the Big Brother All-Stars started last night and 20 housemates went into the house from f six seasons, season 2 through to season 7, had, had housemates go in, 20 of them in total. Sissy was there, Alex was there, Yura was there, White's Money... Messi, K, EK, um, Alex, I think I mentioned Alex before, uh, we had Tolani Badge, we had, um, Neo, we had, we had, who am I forgetting? We had Pere, we had Doi, we had Adekunli, we had Kidwaya. We have the number, we have some other people that I can't even remember right now, which was fun to watch. At first, when I was seeing the people coming, I was first thinking, is it people who could not make it in their career, they're trying to have a revamp, so that way they're coming back into the Big Brother house. When I saw White Money and Messi, I was like, okay, maybe it's not so. I like to know what business they invited, who they invited. I want to know who did they invite that turned down the offer. I want to know that as well. But things will be a bit different now. And I say it will be a bit different because, yes, we have seen a number of people's strategies. When they were in the house, it's possible that um, people like White Money, when they know that Cookie was the strategy and Cookie was going to win in the show. But now we, people have seen it, so I'm sure that his cooking will no longer be a strategy. We want to see what new strategies people will come out with. Um, want to see because the pressure is high now. Because that time people went there when they got evicted, all of their excuses were I know I promised I was going to bring fire, I know I promised I was going to, you know, be the star of the show, but at the end of the day, I did not expect it was going to be like that. So now everybody that is in the house have experienced Big Brother before. So I would like to see what they do different now. There's no longer an excuse of why you did not go far, and what you did, what what was happened. Because everybody have experience, people are on the same side, on this, having the same starting point now. Ex BB Niger housemates, you know how the show works. So, I would love to see who goes far and who wins. With the previous winners like White Money and Mercy be the ones to win. Or we did drop out along the line and other people who could have won their own seasons 
we're winning this time. I'd love to see what Angel would love to do do again. I might be on them and um we'll see how the things come up. So let me know who do you who are you anticipating for to win? Uh, who are you looking out for this um season of the Big Brother and I just season eight all star edition? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to like this video, share this video. And yeah. Subscribe to the eccentric site. If I could just close this. If this we just agree to close. I don't know why it is opened. The eccentric guys. 